Hey guys, Owen here with Seek Outside, and I wanna show you how to set up the Red Cliff full nest inside of the Red Cliff. So let's get into that now. So as always, first thing we're gonna do is open up the bag, go ahead and get our nest. Again, this is gonna take up the full interior of the Red Cliff, but what we're gonna look for here is I like to find the zippers. That's gonna go where the door goes. So right here, you'll see that we have an L zipper. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just kinda go from there, push all this in to the shelter, kinda get my door area, and then I'm gonna tie that off to the stake. So there's two ways you can go about it. If you're just using the nest for one time, it is easier just to tie off to the stake because you can take the nest down easier. But if you're planning on keeping this in, for summer, I like to go ahead and tie off to the guy out points. Um, so I'll just go ahead, leave some slack the whole time you're tying off. I'll just tie a simple little slip knot around that stake loop, tighten it down. I'm just gonna leave some slack so I have something to play with in here. After you've got the doors tied out, from there you have a bunch of spots to stake out from. So this is going to go all the way it's going to skip one point here and go all the way out to the corner in this use case because i'll be taking it down i'm just going to go ahead and go to the stake and i'm going to do that for the other side over there so in this case i'll just kind of pull it over there and then i'll go back to the outside and what i'll do is i'll just reach underneath the tent grab my corner and there should be enough slack in this that you go ahead and grab your line lock, get it all tensioned up here. And I'm just gonna tie off to this stake, just like last time. Now that I have one side of the nest staked out, what I like to do is go ahead and get my pole inside the nest. Um, just get it, you'll see in here, there's this black sewn in cordura here on the floor. So what I'll do is I'll drop the pole down as low as it goes. And I'm just gonna move that, pull my tension out and try and get this Cordura centered. Go ahead and put my pole there and raise it back up. Uh, just like we did on the, this side, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and push all the corners towards the corner so I can access them from the outside. Go ahead and find the corner of your nest and go ahead and just pull it to your stake loop. Just like that. And then our final one, go ahead and pull it. Get your cordage, bring it to your stake. And go ahead and tie it down. And now what we can start doing is taking our line lock tensioners and just tightening up the, the floor. So we'll go around and try and keep everything pretty even. Now this is optional, uh, but we highly recommend it, especially if you're guiding your shelter out. We have toggles here on the nest. They're gonna hook into the spots all around the rest of the shelter. Go ahead and hook those in. And once you get the nest all staked up, it's gonna go ahead and those toggles are gonna to be all connected to your guy out points. Once you have all your toggles uh, staked out to your guy out points, now there's really just two other things to do here. Uh, you'll see that we have a cone up here at the top um, and we also have some toggles up here. So what we're gonna do I dropped the pole now. I'm gonna go ahead and put it through this top area and connect it to the cone. I'm gonna push the cone with the pole back up to the center. The last two things are you have some line lock tensioners. So if you need to pull some more tension in your nest, all you have to do is pull these down. And then for complete bug enclosure, you can go ahead and take this cordage and tighten it, and this will wrap around your pole like that. If you're looking to keep your Red Cliff full nest in your Red Cliff more permanently, we also have these toggles up near the top of the nest that can connect where the liner would normally go into. You can get these guys connected, so when you pack up your tent, the nest doesn't get all folded up. Now that you know how to set up your Red Cliff full nest, all that's left to do is close up your L zipper, from the top, 
and then from the side and enjoy a bug-free camping experience. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys now know how to set up your Red Cliff Full Nest. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and shoot us an email at info at seekoutside.com. And, and any other questions, you can drop them down here in the comments below. You guys have a great day.